I'm sure sure all the week you guys have seen a lot of pages on Instagram, on Twitter, on you know TikTok talking about Lord Lamba and Queen's Gist. Like everybody has an opinion about it, everybody has something to say. And in this week video, I'm going to be touching on that. You know, I also have something to say, so let's talk about it. If you don't already know I'm messy, please subscribe for more videos like this and you know get me to 1000 subscribers. Thank you. So Queen Messi is a big brother Nigeria ex out me. She's an Instagram influencer. I really did not know much about her until last week and I'm like, hmm, okay. So Queen Messi made a post on Instagram on the 29th of February where she announced that engagement to King David. A lot of congratulations were coming in from celebrities, from you know influencers and a lot of people, friends and family. It was all good until that same night, Lord Lama made an Instagram post about his daughter. And everybody was like, wait, what? Is that not Queen's daughter? And knowing fully where that Queen just announced that engagement to another man, which is not Lord Lamba. So everybody was like, wait, hold up. You are petty. You are so petty. Let me take you guys back a few months ago. So Gist Lamba got a gist that Queen was pregnant and it was, she was pregnant to Lord Lamba. That was like a few months ago. And Lord Lamba came out to, you know, defuse it and he's like, no. That's not his baby. She's not pregnant for him. Blah, 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 blah. All this while, Queen never said anything to the media. She posts her child regularly on Instagram. And you know, Nigeria, there's like a there's like a stigma around baby mamas. Like, who is the father? Everybody wants to know who the father is. Who is the father? Who is the father? Who is the father? She never responded. Not up to that night where Lord Lamba claimed the daughter. After months of saying that is not his daughter. Just because Queen just got engaged. Like, can you guys see the petty? To me, I can see the petty. Like, what, what is going on? And another point to notice, the picture of his daughter he posted is not just any random picture. It's like a professional shoot for a one-year birthday, which Queen had posted, you know, aside of the photo shoot on her Instagram when the daughter was one year old. And Lolama really did not post anything. So he's posting all this professional picture that he could have posted ages ago. He's posting it now that Queen announced her engagement. Like, what are you doing, sir? What are you doing? That's not that's not right. I don't see that's petty. So he posted all these pictures and people were like, no, this is so wrong. Let this girl shine. Let her breathe. Like she posted, it was not up to two hours after she made the announcement of her engagement that Lord Lamba came online and posted their daughter. Then, you know, a lot of battling was going on in his comment section. Like, oh, you are petty. You know, people were really going after him. And even his celebrity guys and his influencer guys, they were really attacking him. Like, you are so cruel. Like, let this girl breathe. You've come out before to say you're not the father. So why are you saying the father now? And he was making a lot of points like, oh, no. Is his daughter. He really did not want to put his daughter's face on the internet. Like he knows how people talk bad about celebrity kids. So he really did not want to put his daughter on the internet. And people are like, okay. No, that's valid. That point is valid. But why are you then posting it now? This is still a child. She's just one year old. So why are you posting that child now? Do you see? People came up with a theory that Queen got engaged to you know a very good boy is based abroad and maybe after this their engagement they will likely relocate and you know her and her daughter will relocate abroad so maybe that's what lord lamba is afraid of and is you know making it public like oh this is my daughter or just in case the mother wants to and at this point was like why like at this point another man has stepped up why are you coming here to mess up yourself? Why are you coming here to embarrass yourself? We really don't give a fuck. Queen did not address this. She never said anything. From the 29th of February, one week after she had a pre-wedding photo shoot, you know, she posted that again. And it was like, yeah, everybody was so happy for her. The internet is so happy for her. One week after her pre-wedding shoot, she did her introduction slash engagement. Then she did a court wedding recently. And Lolama, I'm very sure he lost this case in the court of internet justice. He lost it because what do you mean you are coming back here to tell us, oh, this is my daughter, after you've publicly said, oh, this daughter is not mine, no, 
the pregnancy she's carrying is not mine no blah 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 and there been several rumors that lolamba is not an active dad you know he's not there he doesn't even want to see them they don't even spend time with him that much personally i'm with queen i ride with queen and you know good luck to her good luck on her journey i'm very sure this wedding is going very fast because she will probably relocate to the us and i'm so happy for her but i really don't know how it will turn out because it's looking like lord, lord lama will sue for custody of the child and i just hope a messy situation will not come out of this whole thing and i just hope they don't have to like battle it in court and i feel lord lamba has the finance he has the means to always travel to meet them abroad so i don't see why he should be scared of his daughter basing abroad so yeah that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed today's video please like comment and subscribe